happy what is today Tuesday happy Tuesday Tuesday taco Tuesday you know we're not gonna do tacos tonight um, all right coming to you live from my home office here in Chicago how's everyone doing as you're tuning in make sure you say hello I'll be flipping back and forth as you know I simulcast on my fan page as well as my personal page I'm gonna keep this short and sweet and really direct um, because I have three hours of calls after this starting in about 10 minutes. So it's going to be a fast one today. I'm talking about how our team did $146,000 in sales in the last 24 hours all online. Would you like to know how that is happening? The other day we did 97,000 in sales in 24 hours. Like it's absolutely ridiculous what is happening with our team. Our team is amazing. Um, but I want to share with you, to help you out with you and your team and your company, um, kind of just a few of the things that we are doing. All right. Um, so, hey, Sarah, how are you? Hey, Bill, how are you, friend? Denise, what's up? Um, yeah. So, when you're as you're tuning in, like I said, I I don't have a lot of time. I have three hours of calls to get on, but I did want to hop in and say hello. Uh, happy Tuesday and bring you a couple tips on how our team is growing so fast. So um, if you're new to me, first of all, uh, write new in the comments. I always like, love to meet new people. Let me know where you're tuning in from. And after this broadcast, head over to createsuccesswithjulie.com, my website, and grab uh, yourself one of the many free resources over there. Also, uh, you want to get on my fan page because I have over, oh my gosh, I don't even know, over 300 Facebook Live trainings I have done. <laughs> so there's a lot. There's a lot there. But if you're struggling with something like social media or branding or mindset or how to grow your online business or creating multiple income streams um, and you're looking for videos and trainings on that, make sure you head over to my fan page. And I'll put the link in um, well, if you're on my fan page, you know my fan page. I'll put the link on my personal page so you guys have it in the comments when I am done with this um, live. Okay, so how is our team growing so unbelievably quickly? Well, I believe that, first of all, we create an amazing culture and community within our team. And if I do have any of my team members on this live, um, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe that we have so much support on our team. Uh, we have some of the most amazing leadership, I think, in the profession of network marketing. You know, I've been in network marketing now for six years, and I thought my last home was going to be my home. But just like anything, um, you learn as you go and you grow. And I realized that was not the place for me. It's just like a relationship where you fall in love and you're like, oh, I'm going to marry this person. And then you start seeing all of the flaws, but you become smarter in the meantime. So you know exactly what you're looking for in a relationship moving forward. This is how I met my husband. So my network marketing company now, this is my home. This is my home. I will not be leaving. I will not go anywhere else. I actually have a training company. So I uh, coach other network marketers, affiliate marketers, and I coach other coaches. And so I know a lot of the other companies out there, you guys. And I will tell you, for me personally, hands down, there are certain key criteria I look for. I'm not going anywhere. And if I end up leaving, I will leave network marketing as a whole. But I don't want to leave network marketing because I love residual income. And I love building a legacy, right, for my family. So here's the deal. This is what we're doing so you can apply this into your own team and your own business. First of all, anyone that says duplication, duplication is important, but I'm going to tell you right now, uh, duplication on the front end, I feel does not exist. The way that I recruit people is through attraction marketing. Okay. That's just how I do it. That's how I teach my team to do it. Okay. But I have taken, I built a brand, right? I teach, this is why I teach branding. I, all of my income streams go back to me building a personal brand. I'm sorry. This is why personal branding is so important. Um, however, if I was to take an introvert and say, okay, walk into this mall and go and get yourself, you know, 10 phone numbers and then you come to me. 
and I give her this script or I give him this script and I say, okay, now go over and they're introvert and they're going to be like, hell no, I don't want to go talk to people. Like that's weird. I just don't want to go approach people and pitch people all day. That's not really duplicatable. I wouldn't do it. And I'm an introvert, but I'm also an extrovert. Like it's really weird. Like I can strike up conversations with people. However, I don't want to pitch them. Okay. Does that make sense? So the upfront process of duplication, I, I don't, I feel like everyone has to find their own way. However, on the back end, you better have a system set in place. Okay. So we have a system set in place. We have groups that we put prospects into that has a ton of social proof that this is where we house our videos. So we're not sending out links like I did in my last company where I literally had to send an email to every prospect with links. Okay. No, we don't do that. We do everything online through Facebook. Okay. It's really cool. So we have this system, it's pretty much dialed in. We have amazing um, testimonials. So sometimes when we're talking to our audience, our whole point is just, just to get them in the groups and just to get them in front of the presentation and in front of the testimonials, okay? There's no other ulterior motive. There's no other hidden agenda. It's literally just, hey, you wanna see the presentation, okay? Do you wanna check this out? Um, so the back end system is pretty dialed in. We also have team chats. Team chats are super important, I feel, as well as team groups for business, okay? Um, so the team chats help for camaraderie. It helps for when, you know, um, those of us are doing our lives and let's say our lives need a little love, right? Where they're supporting one another. Um, so the back end system has to be really dialed in and if you don't have a system you got to get one done okay I highly recommend groups I have start having your team put in testimonials for social proof having your videos um, inside of the group and being active within the group okay until you start getting it up and running it's like a rolling steam engine right okay having a simple order process now in my last company what do I mean well it was a nightmare it was a nightmare because not only did I have to spend forever talking to them about the system that we had, um, our health system, I had to go through and take down all of their information. Now all I do is send out a link and I make it very non-invasive. Our team makes it very non-invasive. Like, hey, do you want to go shopping? Check out our site. Right? We, we treat it more like a store. Like, let's go shopping in our store because so many people could now associate that because of the moving trend with shopping online, okay? So it's really, really, really cool the way that we have that set up. So again, make sure that you are keeping it very simple for your customer, okay? If you start overwhelming them, they're not gonna do anything. However, if they say, yeah, I'm ready to order, this is where you wanna start talking to them about some upsells, right? Like adding in maybe a, another product here or there, and like, Oh, this will complement this, right? So our our team has gotten really good at doing um, upsells, cross sells, things like that. And so I don't have time to get into all of that right now, but just know if something complements your system or your products, um, you know, always meet the customer where they're at. It's super important. So you have to find out number one uh, the solution that's right for them, and always, always, you guys, always speak benefits always and help them to visualize what it's going to be like when they get on your product okay i don't really talk features i never talk features maybe once in a while if i'm talking to someone that's like hey i need vegan or gluten free okay so i'm talking about that and i'm talking about how we have non-toxic products like yeah that's a given but i'm not diving into the science if they want the science they're going into one of the groups and they're watching one of the videos i i don't do science and i do not do not do comparison. I did this with somebody this week that actually reached out to me and was like, hey, so what's the difference between your blank and this and others that are out there? And I'm like, listen, I don't get into comparisons, but this is what I could show you. This is what I could, you know, um, give to you, right? And you could check it out for yourself. Boom, she ordered that day, right? So um, just being that tour guide and giving them the information because we don't have a lot of time especially at the end of the month right to sit there and with one customer for an hour to give them a dissertation on the science 
all right? Stop being rude. It's just saying, listen, and it's not, that's not duplicatable, right? If you want to talk about duplication. Um, all right, follow up. So we have something called follow up Friday, but I literally like follow up. I, I mean, I think most of our team does a really good job of this is following up within 24 hours. Hey, so I put you in the group. What did you think of the information? You know, let's connect. So we use messenger a lot for everything. We don't do any three way calls. We don't do any events. We don't do any home parties. These 146,000 in sales with our entire team came overnight just online. And we utilize Messenger because that's an amazing tool that is provided to us. And I, we use the audio because when people hear your voice, it, it like triggers this connection to you like so much faster than if they're just reading the text. So I voice everything. And I'm always following up with people. I'm like, listen, if you're not interested, cool, I'm going to take you off my list. Just let me know so I don't bother you so I don't continue to reach out. It's enough, no skin off my back, and that's how I treat it. So when I follow up with people, I'm like, hey, Sue, listen, and here's another thing. Weekends are awesome for follow-up, guys. But since we're end of month and it's today's last day, you want to reach out to people like, hey, listen, I know life gets busy. I know you were super excited about possibly trying X product. Um, just let me know. Uh, and, you know, here's another thing, cut uh, promos, like giveaways. So Today's the last day. So I might do a Facebook Live and I'll say, hey, anyone that orders today is going to get some samples of my blank, right? So if you can give away some, some samples, because we have like individual packets of certain um, products that we have. Um, we also have a capsule that um, like really is it's plant-based, but it's really awesome um, for energy and it's a natural thermogenesis and all this stuff, right? Basically, it gives you energy and you feel really good and it helps to your metabolism. So I might say, hey, um, anyone that orders today, I'm going to give you a Sam. I'm going to send you a gift pack of my three top favorite products, some samples. Okay. Your customers are investing in you and they're believing and trusting in you and this product. And of course, letting them know there's a 30 day money back guarantee. There's no loss. But yet why not make it fun for them and say, Hey, I'm going to give away some samples. So they're investing in you They're You're going to make money off the sale. You know, but here's the thing you have to provide. I, I believe that not at all the time, but I will do some samples or I will do a raffle for a giveaway. It, but you've got to give them a time frame. It's that whole fear of missing out. It's that fear of loss. But when I say time frame, like you better stick to the time frame, okay? Don't do like, oh, so I'm gonna go another day. No, 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 no. It's gotta be that time frame, you guys. So follow up, follow up, follow up um, is super, super important. Um, okay, and then Facebook Lives. Facebook Lives are something that our team has done really effectively. They have done um, challenges. Um, they've done a 21 day challenge. They have done um, actually the most recent challenge that my Australia team has done and it was brilliant. Um, and the leaders in Australia did like a little giveaway to make it fun. They did a 14 day, I believe a 10 or 14 day, two minute Facebook live. Anyone could do anything you guys for two minutes. I know there's a lot of fear around Facebook live. But here's the thing, what I saw in that group, and I have a group for every country. So I have an Australia group, I have a group for my Europe team, I have a group for Canada, and I have a group for US, just FYI. So that's how I kind of organize the teams. So I have several different, I'm sorry, when I mean group, I'm, I'm sorry, I should say um, chats. I have group chats for Australia, New Zealand, Canada, Europe, US, and then with some of my leaders, okay? So, um, with the Australia team, there was so much fear around doing Facebook Live. So we came up with a two minute challenge because we know anyone could do something for two minutes. And what we saw, it was absolutely amazing. People were breaking out of their shell. People were coming out of their comfort zone. They were excited. They were looking forward to doing their Facebook Lives. They were loving the, the reception. They started seeing action happen on their page. That's what Facebook Live does, you guys. And so um, it was just really, really, really brilliant what they did. I'm sorry, I'm looking at my watch because I have to be on a call right now. Um, 
So there you have it, you guys. There are some tips. If you found value in this, put value in the comments. Please share it because I know there's other teams out there struggling like with, with ideas of what to do. Um, so having that back-end system to be able to plug people into, being the tour guide, please understand that you are not there to have to give a full-blown 45 minute presentation. Nope, just get the person in front of the information. When they ask questions, say that's a great question. You know what? I have a, a, a video on that. I have an article on that, right? That's exactly what I did when she questioned me about this our product we have, right? In the comparison. Uh, make it simple for the customer. Make it a simple order process. If you want to take their information, go ahead and take their information. I used to be a control freak about it myself. However, now I'm like, here's the link check it out like I'm talking to them throughout the day and and they order it's not like fear of loss it's like hey no here check it out and um, let's get your order in today and get you because then I do the giveaways okay um, follow up and then Facebook live to build your brand and do like a two minute live challenge for 14 days 21 days 10 days whatever it is um, because it worked it worked tremendously for our team and they started seeing action okay all right guys listen i hope that helps i hope that helps but um yep just go out there rock your business crush it um if you feel like something is holding your you back let me know drop it in the comment section i love doing these trainings i actually trying to get on a schedule to do them uh, every tuesday so i hope you found value Take care. Hey, what's up, Catherine? Love you, girl. Hey, Cheryl, how are you? Sorry, guys. I know I'm kind of moving fast today, but uh, all right. I'm going to cut it there. Have a good one, guys. See you soon.